functional neurological disorders are essentially the gray zone which we, we we're learning more and more about it it's something which we don't structurally see on the conventional diagnostic techniques like mri or ct scans or eeg but it doesn't mean it's not there it is essentially a disorder of your mind or or even the brain because you know, there are some functional changes seen on your pet scans in functional neurological diseases also it's basically a way that your software is not reacting correctly to whatever triggers that are coming to you I always use this analogy for my patients hardware and software so for example we know epilepsy is a hardware problem because there's there might be structural troubles or uh, it uh, metabolic troubles genetic troubles which lead to epilepsy or another uh, billions of things that may lead to epilepsy but that's essentially a hardware problem similarly functional neurological disorders and specifically functional seizures is a software problem so it might not be very visible but it's definitely there and there's lot of ways to tackle them and why talk about functional neurological disorders in relation to epilepsy because it's a very common comorbidity that we see in persons living with epilepsy it's a very common experience all to 50% of people living with epilepsy have experienced functional seizures which is not a small thing and it has immense impacts on the quality of life and on various aspects of your life 